Hey everybody, this is Joel Toppin with GMT Games. And uh, one of the projects I've been working on over the past year, actually past two years, has been uh, a game designed by Vocal Runkey, the game called Indian Abyss. And I've done some videos of it, but uh, what I've got here to show in this video is some uh, an advanced look at some of the components that the game will come with. I don't have, obviously, an advanced copy of the game, but this is what some of the components are going to look like, and I thought it'd be kind of cool to see just how awesome the quality is on these. Um, there are going to be octagonal cylinders for the uh, gorilla factions. This is uh, one of the FARC uh, gorilla pieces. They're embossed on one side to show which sides are uh, active and which are underground. And you also have the uh, bases. Uh, we have these little pawns that you can use to keep track of your resources and also to keep track of who is eligible to play. Uh, one of the really cool things they did with this is looks like we're going to have wooden dice, which is uh, kind of a cool thing. I know some people may not be a fan of wooden dice, but I always think they're really elegant. And it goes with the colors of each faction. So that's the Fark faction. And here's the AUC pieces that we have. So you can see these are also embossed look really nice. Uh, we did have a few issues with the government pieces and the cartel pieces. I uh, didn't like really how the leaves looked on the cartel pieces so we asked them to redo that and the new ones look really cool. I just don't have any on hand to show you what the new ones look like but the leaves look a little bit more like what you'd expect uh, like a coca leaf. So this is what the uh, cartel pieces will look like. and government pieces. Uh, there was a little mix up with some of the colors uh, with the government pieces so I don't have the dark blue cubes but I do have the dark blue bases and the resource and uh, eligibility pawns. One of the other very cool things that you're going to get with the game is white and black wooden pawns to mark where you're going to do different operations and these are about the size I would say of those in oh what's that card game? Battle Line? except they are uh, going to be white and black, they're wooden pieces, very elegant. This is going to be one really cool uh, box. There's going to be a lot of neat stuff in the package. So if you haven't pre-ordered Indian Abyss, if you're just kind of on the fence about it, there's some really neat stuff that's going to come with the game. This is just a quick, simple look at some of the advanced comp uh, pieces, advanced components to the game. So. Uh, Hope you check this one out. Again, um, had a few, few few little issues, but they've corrected them, and it's going to look really great. So if you haven't previewed this, or if you haven't pre-ordered Andy and Abyss, uh, you might want to do that after seeing these pieces. Thanks.